Hey, welcome back. We are playing FF9. We just made it to the outer continent. Yay! Ah! Whoosh. Outer continent, still not lacking uh, mean things that want to bite our ankles. Well, they really don't like Plucky. Okay, so they have quite a bit of health. Man, I really wish I had that scan ability that 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 awful asshole Lanny has. Uh, yeah, sure, attack, just attack. No, don't you dare run away! No! Oh, okay, you're still here. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, that did a lot of pain. Come on. Come on, come on. I want to eat this invisible man. Don't tran- don't tran! Stone! Oh, What a waste. What a- what a well-used trance. Not at all wasted. This is like trying to catch Pokemon, except more laborious. Yay, we learned Goblin Punch! Yay! Waste of time! Oh, we gotta level up out of it, at least. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, ooh, where are we trying to go, anyway? Ah! Somewhere with less monsters, I guess, is where we want to go. Ah, oh, this thing keeps following us. Stray out of the last episode. Go away. Yeah. Slaughtered. We in Turkey tonight, fellas. There's a marsh over there, so let's go there. <laughs> Why? Uh Yeah, you're real scary. Well, let's, you know, let's just, uh... Let's see what Goblin to Punch does. It's probably really weak. No, actually, you know what? That's not the worst damage in the world. Oh, That was a spicy hit. Spicy! Oh, that's actually a pretty good heal. I'm glad we learned it. We <laughs> learned it. We learned it. I can speak. I know how to speak with words and such. Okay, into the marsh. Oh boy. 
It's everyone's favorite part of the game. Lucky, can I catch frogs? Uh, thank you. Uh, Queen of catching frogs. Queen of catching frogs. I mean, lick a dong. Oh, golden frog. Come. Oh. Trixie. Trixie little frogs. They do not want to be eaten. Aha. And so it begins. Ah. Yes, got the golden frog. Got the golden frog. Golden frog hype. Come to me. It will all be mine. Oh, it's right, right there. Look at Tongue. No. Look at Tongue. No one to get hands with. <laughs> Look at Tongue, please. Yes. Uh, female frog. For the tadpoles. Tadpoles like caviar, except ooh, more weekly. Yes. Come on. Come on. Uh, uh, don't tease me. This is how that Disney film should have ended. <laughs> the princess and the frog. Where they're just both riding on that alligator's belly and then Lickitung comes along and he's like, Yeah! Eats both of them. And, and the alligator. Oh! How you get here? You, uh, what's his voice? I gave him like a super, you, you working hard, Lickitung. You come far along way of Garmond. I give you this silver fork. Uh, thank you, Master Quail. How you get here again? Uh. <laughs> I love Lickitung. Best character in the game, IMO. Come here. Come here. We're not leaving until we get this last bastard. There we go. We out. Had enough look at tongue. I'd never have enough. There's just no more frogs. Oh. Um, so, like, where do we want to go? I know there's like a good. This game's version of dwarves in the outer continent, like they have a settlement somewhere nearby. Oh, uh, this is creepy music. I think this is a friendly enemy, though. A friend of me. Oh, hello. Oh, look at this little cutie. You want some? Oh, I'll give you some more. There you go. And I'll see you right back. Is that enough for you? Okay, wow. Oh, please, please give me some more. Just give me some more ore. Here you go. Oh, this is pleasant. This should be the entire game. Alright. Tell Yeti I said hello. Okay. Ooh. That was nice. You know what? Make love, not war. Whoosh. Nah, never mind. We're gonna make war. We're gonna scream bloody murder as we mm, slaughter these fools who dare approach. Oh, it's a big pig. Oh, my throat is so hoarse right now. There you go. Lickitung, unlike uh, many other, many others of the Ku Clan, of the Q Clan, uh, wasn't born with a silver fork in, his, in their mouth. We came all this way, and there's still no mist at all. Yeah, and what a weird shape. Uh, village? What even is this thing? Maybe it's a temple of some kind. <laughs> 
is very delicious shape. Inside might have fan cuisine. <laughs> Jeez, all I ever think, all I ever think about is food. Well, all you ever think about is girl. Uh, that's right. My mind is filled with thoughts of uh, you. Damn. <laughs> you think? You think, Plucky? Rally ho! Rally ho! Rally ho! Oh, what, what's up with these little guys? R rally, rally ho! R rally ho! Rally ho! Hey, hold up! Rally ho! Oh, come on! Rally ho! Oh, sacred greeting! If you didn't say rally ho, then you can't enter the petty. I'm ten of the dwarves. Now wait just a minute. Rally ho! Uh, ra rally ho. Rally ho, you can pass. <laughs> this is gonna be fun, huh? Horse and the couple. Couple of what? Hmm, the, the people here are sure are different. Come here, there, yeah. Uh, I'm talk And just where do you think you're going? You are always loitering around. Whist, would you stop heckling me for once? Away with you. Um, pardon me, but where would you be without me? Y you didn't have to get so angry. If you did, you didn't want to hear me complaining. You'd get back to work. Uh -huh. All right, woman. All right. Lazy, no good husband of mine. Hmm? Mercy me, are you, are you, we won, running the errands here, are you? Um, pardon me, but, well, give me regards to the others. And then they went to make sweet love. Gee whiz, the people here aren't afraid of me. You have to raise your hand up and open your mouth wide when you say really ho. Welcome to our turn. We came to this continent looking for someone. We didn't get many outsiders here. Okay. I'm sorry if this is a horrible accent. Mm, terribly offensive. Rally ho! <laughs> oh my god, look at Tom. <laughs> he just he just drops his regular voice and he's just like, oh rally ho yourself, you fuck bucket. <laughs> This, <clears throat> does this village have tasty munches? My throat is so sore. Aye, that would do. Condipete is home, home to the most delicious nuts and berries in the world. I can, that's why the folk are always stealing of food. I would feel very bad people. Aye, that's right. Mmm, lots of yummy looking food here. I'll let you have that pumpkin bum there for a thousand gil. Huh? Why do you need gil to eat food? If you didn't pay for something you're stealing. Och, so you're a thief all you know. No, not me, I only command. You can't fool me, thief. No! Holy moly. What an outsider doing here? Hi, have you seen a strange looking guy here? He goes by the name of Kuja. Real strange looking. No, you see, uh, he looks really sinister and uh, you're a sinister looking. Yeah. Oh, this is my dog now. Back off, this is my dog. Hey, hey boy. He, see, he loves me, he loves me. Come on, boy. He's following me, he's following me. Okay, fine. Lickitung can't communicate. What else is new? I didn't ken what else we can do, lads. Oh, recipe exchange time, yes? Nay, that thief's been snitching her food again. I I'm not thief. Nobody said you were a thief. Or are you hiding something? I, I have nothing to hide. These people's so typical. Alright lads, we have to keep our eyes open if we're gonna catch our thief. But we're always looking out for thieves, are we now? 
Ja. So. You didn't expect me to work on such a fine day as this, do you? Yeah, well, okay, well. This bed may be small, but she'll do you good enough. I like my bed small, I don't want my limbs just dangling over the edges. Saucy boy and William. Excuse me. Soon I'm gonna have to find a wife for me, my wee William. No lassie wants ya, William, for a man. Well, that what's wrong with this outside the lass right here? Um, hi, I was wondering, hmm, ah, uh, she's a bunny lass at that. Have any of you seen, but she's awful small to send to the sanctuary, don't you, Ken? Look at her, she's a mickle bigger than, uh, and you can I'm not marrying anybody. Hmm, sanctuary. I have changed my mind, I will marry this William. Someday I want to be joined to Betsy on top of this cook, but... And afterward we'll go to the sanctuary to inscribe our names together. Here a man and woman are joined by the blessing of the sun. Of course, we're a wee bit young to receive the blessing just yet. Okay. Kelly Finger Waver. <laughs> This is where we give thanks to the sun in the heavens. Hey, horse. What's the matter, horse? Um, these two people. That hen you cooked for me was awful good. It was. What did you cook? What did you, uh, What way did you cook it? Did you frizzle it with some of your magic? The berries you traded me were stoned in two. But like, say, what's a wee lad like you doing here today? Hey, off, do you know those people? How could I? I've never been here before. Yeah, I didn't think so. I'll try talking to some other people. Mm-hmm, Peppa. This is where... okay. Hungry Brian. Sis, I'm hungry. But you just ate a boiled owl, did you not? Ugh. I did, but it didn't satisfy my voracious appetite. I have to eat something with more punch, like say, eh? Uh, Rally ho! It's Mr. Pointy Hat. Rally ho! What have you to sell today? Oh, the plot thickens, eh? That's the cookbook, symbol of condipetti. What's about doing up there? The boat? I don't know, Ken, what you're talking about. What's a boat? I can I let you pest, laddie? Fine. Go finger wave yourself then. <sighs> hmm? Plenty thanks, your goods are always welcome here. Hey! What the? Wait, wait! Hang on, horse. This is fun. I'm having fun. <laughs> Come back, horse! Blocky, what's going on? I have no idea, but we can't catch up with horse. Yeah. Horse, where's the black mage? He ran away. Huh? Where the heck did he come from? Has Bran found us? Do you ken the pointy hats? Huh? Did you just say pointy hats? Nay, I said pinty hats. How about you get the biscuits out of your ears? They often come from the southeast forest to trade with us. They? You mean there's lots of them? And they live near here? Aye, but you got to go the way around the young cliff and then go east to find the southeast forest. They live so deep in the forest that even owls didn't live there. What's that supposed to mean? Okay, I want to go to the southeast forest and find them. Yeah, me too. I think that's a good idea, we might find some clues. If possible, to try new food anywhere fine. All right, let's head to the southeast forest. Maybe we can lose lick tongue in there. Let's go. Let's go to the southeast southeast forest. Very interesting choice to make them sound the way they do. 
Here we are. I think they live so deep in the forest that owls don't even live there. Oh, okay, so that's a clue. So we don't want to go down the path where the owls are, like that one right there. Where there are owls, where there are no owls. No, you're lying to me. Bugger. What? Okay, I'm confused. Where there are owls, where there are no owls. But there's owls there. Okay, I'm a little confused. <sighs> where there are owls, where there are no owls. They live where there are no owls. What? Okay, I'm a little confused. <sighs> where there are owls, where there are no owls. They live where there are no owls. What? Go back, go back. Okay, we did it. That frame rate though. We made it. Oh, this music is bumping. Ah! Oh, humans! Ah! Humans, run! Wait. Did you see them? Yeah. They were talking. They are, there are others like me. Ah, oh, horse. Why would anyone build a village in the middle of a dying forest? Beats me. What's horse? He went that way, but I- Hey! A village! Village always have good food! I go fine! I actually can't do his voice anymore, my throat hurts too much. Jeez, you people. Okay, we'll go through a couple of these uh, active time events, and then we'll call it. The humans are here! The humans are here! Oh, horse. Horse! What's going on? This music, I freaking love it. Why are you here? This is our village. Yeah. You forced the little guy to guide you here, didn't you? That's all you humans ever think about, using us. You mean about horse? That's not true, it's just that I was surprised to see black mages other than horse who could talk, so... Besides, I'm here to stop the person who is sending you off to fight. Uh, are you telling the truth? Lies! Lies! All humans are liars! You're lying! <laughs> but it's true. I can't just sit here and watch while horrible things are happening. Lucky, you want to eat too? Check up the egg, very delicious. We're never gonna give it to you. Oh, look <laughs> that black mage is pissed. Is he the one who came here with that group of humans? He's alright, look into his eyes. He's aware, just like us. Th thanks um... What are you all doing here? We escaped together from Alexandria and the cargo ships. This far? That's right, we wanted to live in a world where there were no, no humans. To find that, we had to cross the ocean. I see. So um, what's this? This is a uh... What's the word? It's a cemetery. Right, a cemetery. A cemetery? So, underneath the ground, 
Yes, our friends are buried under here. But why? That's because I I came here with Mr. 36. We escaped together. We had so many things to learn. It was really scary at first, but we helped each other. Then one day, Mr. 36 stopped moving. He just stopped. Wouldn't move or say anything. My friend who knows lots of things told me that this was what death was, and we had to bury him. Mr. 36 is buried under the ground now, but I don't understand why. He's going to come out again one day, right? When he does, I'm going to wash him off in the pond. What, what's he talking about? Was it a disease, or was he hurt? Tell me, why? It's because... <laughs> I'm a little emotional now. That's heavy. Uh, that's why I like this game, though. Okay, saving. And stopping the episode here. Ah, uh, okay. Thanks for watching. Much love.